We're gonna start on the floor. Bend your left leg and rest your right calf on the foam roller. Start with the foam roller a few inches above your ankle. Support your weight with your hands slightly behind you. Add some pressure on your right calf and start slowly rolling the foam roller up towards your knee. When you find a tender spot, stop and hold it there. Now flex your right foot so you stretch out the backside of your calf. We're going to just hold it here for 35 seconds so that the goji tendon organ is going to be fully activated. You also have the option of pedaling your feet if you want. Alright, let's do the same thing with the left calf. Bend your right leg and rest your left calf on the foam roller. Start rolling slowly until you find the tender spot. Now flex your left toes up so that the backside of your left calf is stretched. Hold for 35 seconds. Next, let's foam roll the outer calf. Let's start with the right side. Come onto your right side, supporting yourself with your right forearm and left hand. Bend your left leg in front of you. Place the foam roll on the outer edge of your right calf a few inches above your ankle. Roll the foam roller slowly towards your knee. When you find the tender spot, hold it. Now rotate your ankle joint gently to relieve the muscle there. Flip over, let's do the same thing with the left calf. Support yourself with your left forearm and right hand. Bend your right leg in front of you for extra support. Roll the foam roller slowly along the outer edge of your left calf until you find the tender spot. Hold it there and rotate your ankle joint gently for 35 seconds. In about 5 seconds, we're going to transition into downward facing dog. Hips up and heels as close to the floor as possible. When you feel the perfect stretch, which is very personal, hold it there. Let's just stay here for 35 seconds to fully activate the goji tendon organ. Staying in down dog, bring your left foot slightly off the floor. Let's intensify the stretch on the right leg. Hold for 35. You can lift your left leg higher off the floor for a deeper stretch. And the next progression would be lifting your left leg all the way up and bending it over, opening up your hip as you deeply stretch that right calf by pressing the right heel close to the floor. In 5 seconds, put your left foot down and bring your right foot up. Hold. Remember that you can lift your leg higher for a deeper stretch.
workout guys remember for best results do this before and after your workouts and also whenever you feel like loosening up your calf muscles especially if you have one of those jobs where you're standing on your feet all day as Aristotle says we are what we repeatedly do anyways i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in the next one